to head back to Mickey and his crew? Sorry, Boris, but that mouse was a little too nice for no reason. So? Come on, bro. No one is that nice without wanting something in return. I don't think Boris agrees with you, Bendy. Thanks, but I know what I'm doing. Besides, I can't just turn down an invitation like that, especially by someone as amazing as Mr. Mickey. He was there for you too, remember? So easily trusting. Why can't you grow up for once? Mm -hmm. Oh! You did not just say that to the precious Wolfie! Boris, don't run away! He didn't mean it! He's just mad! I I'm not going to. I am a grown-up, and I won't act in such a wo- Hey! I hope you're not forgetting that I love you more than anything. Are you? Of course not. You always want what's best for me. I know, I know, but so far, what feels like the best for me feels like the worst. Oh, looks like I was wrong. Nobody got hurt or died. That's good. So, um, I guess we go check up on uh, Mickey and the crew. <laughs> oh, goodness! What happened here? <laughs> Ow, I didn't see that. Are you okay, guys? You all right, Max? Who cares? Uncle Pete's gonna kill me! No, no, it's okay. <laughs> we'll explain things to him, no problem. Just explain it to me first, that is. Nick, don't you notice that Bendy and Boris aren't there? No, oh, not Boris! Anything happens to him, you're the one to blame, Mickey. Eh. Hi, Mr. Mickey. Did Bendy and Boris hear Mickey yell that? Did he just say my Boris? Oh, thank goodness you're safe, but both of you, of course, haha. <laughs> oh, Bendy ain't having any of that. Wait, what are they doing back there? I thought they moved on. I was just angry. I thought it'd be best if we head back. I only did this for Boris. And now that we come back, this frickin' mouse says some stupid things. But Boris, why you? Someone's angry. You know what happened here? Or did you miss it like I did? Well... Sorry, we don't do a lot of touching. It's a family thing. I completely understand your feelings, Bendy. I'd be upset if someone only cared for my bro and not for me. But Mickey is trying to understand what happened here. Please try and collect your head and explain, perhaps? No, it's not that. Thanks for everything, but we're kind of in a hurry. Just ask one of your friends about what happened. I, I can always invite you guys in some other rest. I said we're in a hurry. I know Mickey just took care of him, but how's Ozzy doing? Fish time, huh? Star was Felix then? Did he have to bail? Poor man, how did I get roped into this? Then again, I don't really mind. <laughs> Is Cuphead still in the hospital? You remember what happened that day? Is he okay? M mugs? Huh? Huh? What? Ah, his hair is so fluffy! Thank goodness, Cup is awake! Oh, Mr. Cuphead, you're awake! You! Nurse Fanny? Is there a problem? Aw, oh, crap, what's up with Fanny? Let me hear, shithead! What's the deal, lady? Nurse Fanny, please be nice! But don't just throw your trash here! You're supposed to come back and pick it huh? up. Uh, where have you been? I thought you left me here forever. Ah, he's alive! Oh my god! Oh, I'm so happy! Oh my god! I'm glad you're okay. Never do something like that again! Uh. Wait, Mugman is alive? How will Cuphead react to that? You're real, right? Don't talk to me, I'm mad at you. I I'm not going crazy, right? I, I can see you, I can touch you. Cups? Ped, do you remember what happened before you were in the hospital? <laughs> <laughs> Frickin' same as Lady Nurse Bird thing. Cause you don't feel that cat eyes on him. Hmm? <laughs> if one of the kids showed Felix his mom's old pic, if he had it, this is Mommy. You look like her, mister. Or? But she's so beautiful compared to me. Shut up, Felix. You're beautiful. Uncle Mickey said she went to a better place or something. Or am I? Is Felix alright? He looks like he's seen a ghost or something. Ugh. 
Uh, I'm sorry, your son gave it to me. Mm. Papa? Felix, you fucked up. Can I have my jacket, lovelies? I think I caused enough trouble. But we're making carrot muffins. Bad, Papa! Go to your room! I can understand his actions, but that was rude. Felix never deserved such rudeness. Huh? Hmm. <laughs> or it's fine. I wouldn't have dared look at it in myself anyway. I couldn't say no to that sweet kid. Oh, f for me? Th thanks. So, is this like a new mom? Bibs on his head! Oh, are you staying, Felix? I can't stay. I'll just enjoy this day while it lasts, hoping that we'll meet again. Fanny, Oswald's ex-girlfriend. Tis loss. He could have had all of this instead of that kitty cat. Fanny, maybe you shouldn't talk like that about someone who died. But do you still hate Benji and Boris, or do you like them now? You remember that night, or day, I don't know, in the restaurant, right? I don't recall too well. I was just running after... I don't know. Nothing mattered for me to care anyway. OMG, Cup, your hair is so floofy! Aw, oh, you're so fluffy! <laughs> nope! I can't deal with this cuteness! I'm out! Finally! I was about to go to lunch without you! I think the birdie nurse is chickening out. <laughs> I think she's nuts for Cuphead. He is kinda cute. You think I should ask him out? What? Girl, he should be the one asking you out. You gotta play hard to get. Miss Bird, sorry, don't know your actual name. Don't listen to Fanny. Don't play hard to get, just be yourself. You seem super nice and optimistic. You should do some good in Cuphead's life. I'm rooting for ya. Oh, don't worry. I'm not planning on going with her advice. I just like talking to my bestie. <laughs> some friend you are. What are the cup bros doing anyways? You sure you don't need more rest? I had all the rest I needed while you forgot me here. <laughs> don't joke about that, Mugs. I went through the worst days of my whole life without you. And all the time, I just couldn't forget about you, even if I tried. Cubby, please. I'm not used to all this love. And stop being so cute! <laughs> Wonder what Bendy and Boss are up to. This is like the second time we caused trouble to Mr. Mickey. Why is he even so like me? Why indeed. We don't do touching, it's a family thing. What was that? Well, I may have lied about the family thing, but I still hate touching. Does Mickey visit Minnie? And don't forget, one dose every day. All right, thank you. Hi, Miss Minnie. Oh, why, hello, Mr. Mickey. So many kids loved your show yesterday. Oh, I'm so glad to hear that. Did, did, did you just say this all happened yesterday? All of that shit happened yesterday? Are you kidding me? So while we're here, I have a question about like... Oh, it's been bugging me for a while. How the hell do you keep track of 420 kids? I mean, you must have lost some on the way here, didn't you? Oh god, I hope you didn't! Oh my gosh! You know, it's not a big mystery why Oswald dumped you, Fanny. I mean, look at ya. Well, I mean, you do act like an utter bitch, but still, you bitch. There you are. We like to book a room with double beds, please. A thing, little man. Aw, oh, you poor thing. And he gets it. Thanks, miss. This room is perfect. Come on, Bendy. Bendy? And never forget. Always keep on looking up. Think of all the tiny places you can fit in. You'll always be on the front lines to concerts, and you'll always have a good laugh when you see all those disappointing reactions of those who thought you were just a kid. Huh? Bro, you're scaring her. Bendy, you are now my life coach. <laughs> I pay in hugs. I'm broke. Oh, Boris, you and Bendy will sleep for tonight? Em, is my brother still with you? No, he said he'll be back soon, though. Hmm, I wonder where did he go? There's no need to make my brother suffer with me every time. And there's no need to alarm the neighbors. <coughs> I just have to suck it up and fight it on my own. Bendy, get your butt back to Boris. You can't handle this alone, and you know it. Do I even put him through such worries every single day? <laughs> He's just a kid. Cry, Bendy.
I can't help it. It hurts so. But I... No, I can't. I thought I was strong, but I, I can't. I need you, Boris. I'm so sorry. Boris! Chris, you might want to find Bendy. Oh, Bendy, where are you? Bendy! Please tell me someone heard the Bendy. Mm. Uh, Boris? Huh? Oh, hey. It's you. I'm okay with you now, Cap. I'm okay with you now. Not before, but now I am. So, um, with that in mind, choose your next moves wisely. Yeah, bitch. Oops, please don't kill Bendy. Do not kill him. Do not kill him. Do not kill him. Do not kill him, please. Where's your brother? W what? As if I'm gonna- I have no intentions of killing him or you right now. You need each other. That's how I earned your respect, didn't I? What? Not as much of an idiot as I thought. If you love your brother this much, then you earn my respect. Be strong. I'm sure he'd want the best for you. Oh shit, you heard that? Mm-hmm. OMG, you really said that, Bendy? That's so cute! This is so embarrassing. <laughs> now tell me, where is he so we can be even? Wait, so are you good now? You won't try and get rid of us anymore? I wish I could, but... Bendy! Horace! So put the yelling and give me what you got, boy. Uh, I don't have anything on me right now, sir. Please just let me go. My brother needs me. What are you two doing? Don't just stand there. Go and help Boris. Hands off the kid. Now. Andy. Uh, uh. Huh? Chris, run while he's distracted. I'm coming, Bendy. Come back here. Huh? Oh, 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 ouch. <laughs> that sound, oh my god, I'm not gonna live that down. <laughs>